Joining us now is a member of the Dr. Phil Advisory Board, it's Dr. Charles Sophie. Uh, he is a board certified uh, psychiatrist in three clinical specialties, adult psychiatry, child and adolescent psychiatry, and family practice. And uh, Dr. Sophie is the medical director for the Department of Child and Family Services here in Los Angeles. First off, the term schizophrenia, do you think that is applicable to this situation in any way whatsoever? I don't. I don't. I mean, you're not losing touch with reality. You know the date, the time, you know where you're at all the time. Mm -hmm. Yes. You're able to bathe and eat and all that. Right, yes. But yeah. it is disturbed. Yeah, definitely. <clears throat> there is a big difference between people that hear voices that are psychotic mm -hmm. and people that hear voices that are just what we call hearers. And you show no signs of psychosis that I can see. Do you see signs of psychosis here? No, nope, not at all. And it sounds funny, but there is a word. It's called hearers. You are a hearer. You are hearing voices that nobody else is hearing. Yes. But you don't have signs of psychosis. Okay. That's good news. Right. That's a good thing, because there are other things that could come with that that would be right. very disruptive to your life. Yes. Okay? The good news is you are not crazy. You've gotten caught in a loop here that we need to break the cycle on. I would highly recommend, which, again, I'm not a big fan of, is that we try and find that medication that is biochemically targeted to help you resist that resistible impulse. And I also think it's important for you to find ways to soothe yourself. And I would recommend biofeedback training for that reason, where you learn to monitor your body and calm yourself. Because when you are in a completely calm state, completely relaxed state, I think you're gonna find that the volume goes way, way down on this stuff. I think mm -hmm. you are sleep deprived. I think you are biochemically in, a, in heterostasis. And I think you don't know how to get into a really calm state. And I think if we do those three things, I think we will yes. take some giant steps forward in a short period of time. And I'm prepared to provide you with the help you need to do all three of those things starting immediately. Okay? Mm -hmm. All right.